Hi, my name is Shay Gines. I'm one of the executive directors of the Innovative Theatre Foundation, celebrating Off-Off-Broadway and independent theatre. I want to thank you for this opportunity to address you in regards to our community. Off-Off-Broadway is comprised of over 40,000 artists and an estimated 500 theatre companies, which makes it one of the largest arts communities in the world and the foundation of New York theatre. Yet it is continually overlooked in terms of funding and state and federal support. New York theater is a destination for audiences and artists from across the country and around the world. With nearly 1,800 productions every year, Off Off Broadway creates opportunities for these artists to practice their art more than any place else. The governor's proposed $6.5 million budget cut to the arts represents a minuscule percentage of the New York state budget, but that money is the lifeblood for these small arts organizations and these cuts would be devastating to the off-off-Broadway community. A thousand dollars to an off-off-Broadway theater company is the difference between doing a production or not doing a production. And six point five million dollars represents half of the off-off-Broadway season. We cannot afford these cuts. I would also like to ask you to consider the tax abatement proposal that is being put forward by the Manhattan Community Boards that offers tax breaks to landlords that either donate or offers a below market value rent to nonprofit theater companies. Over the last six years, Off Off Broadway has seen 26% of their spaces either demolished to make way for developments or repurposed into non performance spaces. With increasing rents and taxes, the remaining spaces are often priced outside the budget for these already cash strapped theater companies. The tax abatement proposal offers an innovative solution that benefits the landlords the theater companies, and the cultural capital of New York State. An investment in Off-Off-Broadway is an investment in New York. Thank you.